happy Monday. Wow. Wow. Um, that was that was a really fast weekend. It was oh. full of full of excitement and uh, and also awful things for me. But uh, <laughs> yeah, you were not feeling well. No, I wasn't. I, I wasn't at all. Um, I had so I, I developed a, a sinus infection, and I have really bad allergies too. So the combination of the two just it all hit its peak on Saturday and Saturday I, I was just down for the count. It was so horrible. Oh, yeah. Sage I, and I, Sage and I, I feel for you people who are allergic to the air where air hurts you in springtime. That's just terrible. Hey, yeah. period. Hello yeah. friends. It's hideous when you have allergies like that. It, and, and it, and it was, it was really, really horrible. Um, I, having a sinus infection with allergies uh the combination of the two and also i it, i think that it was heightened because i have i sleep with a cpap machine so well, i can tell when i'm going to have like a, a a a sinus infection and oh man it was bad it was really bad yeah it was no fun good no. morning guys uh we stood up way too late last night too <gasps> yes we did Chris? but what were we doing um, we were singing. Yeah. It we was karaoke. It was karaoke party. It was impromptu karaoke night with, uh, the kids and some of their friends and wow, we just couldn't stop ourselves until, I don't yeah. know. It was <laughs> so silly, <laughs> but it was fun. Well, we were rolling until like what, one o'clock or so mm -hmm. and, and singing all sorts of songs and, and I, like I told you last night, I just love hearing you sing. It's so great. It's so much fun. Good morning. It just Hi. came. It just came too early. The morning. Wow. Wow. My okay. <laughs> yeah. You and I have to 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 learn a couple more um, uh, 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 duets. And and I want I want to ask I want to ask the community here. What would you like to hear Liz and I sing together? Now we do <laughs> sing quite a few songs, and we, we like we've we've sung uh what is it the, the 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 one from Aladdin? I can show you the world, a whole new world. We've sung that one together. Have I mean we have? It's not a usual, but yeah, and, uh -huh. and of course we've sung the Aaron Neville uh, Linda Ronstadt song. That's a that's a classic. Yeah. So Good morning, I can't believe it's May. I can't believe it. It's Monday. It's May. There are so many things. It's May 2nd. We are not at SoFlo. I would like to go. I was I was debating going this year. I was thinking maybe I would. Um, but there were so many trips right leading up to that. I was like, I just want to be home for a little bit. And uh, yeah, that would be cool. I, I like that. Yeah. John, Johnny Cash and June. Agreed. Yeah, that's a good song too. They're, they're duet. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a good one too. Yes. Oh, see, yeah. I can't believe it. Naomi Judd, man. Wait, I sometimes get them mixed up. Yeah, it's Naomi. Why known as the sister? I get Ashley and Naomi. Sometimes I'm like, wait, Ashley's the daughter. Naomi's mom. Um, that was shocking. Uh, that's uh, we just announced their uh, their farewell farewell tour. It's really sad. And their last performance was at the, uh, I think it was the Country Video Awards or Country Music Awards just uh, about a month ago. Mm -hmm. So that was their their last performance. Yeah. Um, and it was, it, it was mental illness was, uh, is yeah. what the, 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 the daughters have been talking about on socials. And she's we, written books about it. She's, she's written books about that, that she struggles with that. Do, do we know what, what it what it was or what what they announced that but yeah it's it's heartbreaking yeah oh yeah man that's yeah yeah now okay okay here's here's one definitely to uh to, to throw on the list oh uh, what's her name <laughs> lady gaga Lady Gaga, don't, you can't you can't forget Lady Gaga. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Oh, See? 
See, I told you your hair looks rocking today. It looks ridiculous and um annoyed. <laughs> yes, her. Right, right, <laughs> now, right now, everybody wishes that that their hair looked ridiculous as well. I wish my hair looked ridiculous like yours. Look at how beautiful you are. Oh my gosh. Oh I'm gonna turn my camera right about now. <laughs> so, I I woke oh, up so like uh, a couple seconds ago. I mean not a second, but it was like 15 minutes ago. And I'm not I'm not ready for for the camera. I'm not ready for my close-up. Really <laughs> <laughs> you guys are cute. The shallows, yeah. You can't forget him. <laughs> Bradley Cooper, yeah, kind of hard to forget. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and that movie is tragic too. Mm, it's yeah, uh my hair is is very curly. Um <laughs> ridiculous. Good. Oh man. Oh, uh, we're moving on to another topic, such as homework. It's a new month, guys. It's a new month. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Just uh, watch it. I wake up like this. <laughs> Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. Like anybody's hair, right? Yeah. Um, sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't. I, I don't necessarily have bad hair days. I, I don't have any good hair days. But I don't have, like, bad hair days. I just have days. I, I, I have zero care for my hair. Zero. That's nice. That's that's yeah. the goal, right? Yeah. <laughs> but it's a new month, and there's a new, yeah. a new set of cookies. Yes. And so. um, crazy, I can't believe it's May. I, I cannot believe it. Uh, so this was a class that I did in person for the cookie roundup. And then I got some, uh, a lot of requests to do it at Maguyu, which a lot of times in-person classes will turn into a Maguyu. And uh, it just worked out where it just, it was the right time and the right season and the right uh, month to do it. So. We brought it straight to Maguyu from a, from two in person classes to a to a Maguyu, uh, so that is really fun. It was really fun to film it and uh, good. I'm so glad. Yeah, good. You t you're gonna you're gonna do it. You're gonna have so much fun. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, when I first did these, it was I was like, ooh, I don't. They're so the colors are so bold, you know but they really you don't have to do it in these colors either which is really fun i i'm curious to see if anybody does them in different color combinations this is kind of the classic you know that the purple and yellow but um those those flowers come in all kinds of colors and cindy uh, actually actually mentioned on uh, one of the posts in fact i think it was the post in the uh, maguyu student body group on facebook um where i just said hey the the may class is available she really loved the way that you filmed this this class. And I know that you take a lot of time with the piping of these flowers because that's really what the class yeah. is all about. Yeah, I'm so glad because um, it was, they are difficult. Those those flowers are very, I wouldn't say difficult, but it's very precise or intricate about how to do it. So I really wanted to make it clear, like really clear how to turn it. So I spent a lot of time doing that like on that you know like, like focused on the the piping part so i'm really glad i i hope it's very you know very clear because it's a little weird <laughs> yeah <laughs> most of the time it's about a foot and a half away and then some of the shots it's it's literally like a couple inches away um for my for my hands so yeah i i want to really get in there it's almost like I have to work around a camera, you know, because it's that close to kind of see what I'm doing. But yeah, and I, think, I think that there's an advantage to to, to having the class on uh, online because you get yeah. to show that really up close work that, uh, of your hands where in the in-person class, they 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 heard you talk about it. They have the step by step and they mm -hmm. have your help personally in the room. But they weren't able to really see your hands up close like they are. Or rewind the a specific part or, you know, so yes. I think in this case, yeah. it's funny because usually in-person classes are kind of make it easier in a way. But in this instance, I think the, the filming and the actual tutorial will make it easier 
um, than in person. Um, in this case, usually it's the opposite, but I think in this case it's, uh, yeah. Is that wrap around the cookie? Yes. So um, two tea stencils made the cookie cutters for that. I hand cut them, but um, they have a two piece set, two tea stencils.com. It's brilliant. It's the little background and the little, the little wrap. And uh, the wrap is just a really thin cookie. So we just want to pop that up. I did, when I was designing it first, I did the whole thing just on one cookie. And I was like, it's bothering me <laughs> that it's too close to the same dimensions. It doesn't have that, like, it just didn't work for my brain, you know? So just popping it up that little bit, it's so, it makes, it makes such a big difference. Look at this deal, four bucks. Right there. Yeah. And then it's right on the, fr on the front page of the website. And there you go. So easy. cool. I love it so much. Easy peasy. Yeah. What a great deal. Go back to that. Uh, oh. cutter. Yeah. What else do you see? Mm. How cute would that be as a two piece lava lamp cookie cutter? Oh the my God. Favorite. You know, it'd be so cute. Please like tell me you're going to make that for Father's Day. <laughs> a lava yeah. lamp? Father's Day lava lamp? Yeah. Like a hippie set for, for Father's <laughs> Day would be rad. Um, it could be a, uh, what was it? What were we talking about? Um, like a spaceship for sure. That'd be so okay. cute. Like a modern planter. Mm. Would be really pretty. Um, we were talking about flipping. Oh, it'd be a great Las Vegas sign flip to the side. That's right. A lot of signs would work really nice with that or words. That's great. That's great. Yeah. I love cutters that yeah that that you can use in multiple ways, and I know that you love that too. And so you, you always look for ways that you can yeah. use something in other designs. Yeah, Tammy and I were playing with the the, the shape. Hello, Charlotte. Awesome. Yeah. Cool. I can't wait to see. Uh, you should jump right in. Try the do the the homework. Um, and, and you can always rewatch the lives here. That's Good. right. Yeah, I can't wait to see you guys uh, start to turn in your homeworks. Do we have any homeworks? Good morning, Sandra. Yes, there are, and 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 I didn't pull the the, the new homeworks because I was running through so many of them today. Um, there were a lot of homeworks that were turned in this week, as <laughs> we know is the case. Usually, a lot of homeworks we turned in this day. <laughs> it's it's been two days. Oh yes, the, yeah, and today there should be quite a few turned in. Um, I'll have to wait to get it back from Amex. Cookie retreat, how fun! I have to get ahead for work before I, yeah, I know you gotta fit it in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I had to had to coordinate. Usually, I try to get the, at least the feel right. You play over and over, yeah, I think that's key. <laughs> Any that part again? <laughs> And Tammy, uh, Tammy was the first one to, Tammy Coletti was the first <laughs> to post her cookies. And I know that, um, oh gosh, uh, let's see, Danielle Stone also posted her cookies for, uh, for this month. <laughs> and wait, there was, there was, there was at least one more. I'm going to get it. Hold on. Hold on. I'm not going to leave you hanging. I'm going to mention you. So it is Robin Mayo. Who's who's a new a new a annual subscriber, and she also got her homework in uh, already. Okay, I was like going to say, wait, how did? And then I was like, oh yeah, yes, <laughs> so yes, they, yeah. They got they got a little head start on theirs. Oh my gosh, I love that. Old, yeah, little vintage retro little keychain. Oh, Chris, <laughs> maybe 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 Liz can do one of the Golden Palace, which. I know Chris will know is yeah, that's the spinoff of Golden was, Girls. Yes, that was the spinoff. Oh, so good. Yeah. Good job. We'll keep that. would be so funny. Oh, wow. That's awesome. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. I was thinking that too. Like the, yeah. my mom had, had one of those things and it had the, the plant that was in it. It almost looked like there were peas on like the, yeah, that supplement that has a little, uh, yeah. Yeah, little yeah. You, you know which one I'm talking about, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. I, sometimes yeah. I see these things. But you need so much uh, space to play with the lava lamp. I've seen lava lamp cutters, but this one's like, would be nice and a lot of fun area to play on. Um, on a butterfly shape. Oh, like that little, yeah, yeah. The bow tie little section. That'd be cute. Yeah. 
Yeah, Tammy Coletti. That's right. It's he, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she happened to have she happens to have a lot of those cutters too. <laughs> Your cutters are strict, right? No way. No, oh, I should I've never watched it. Okay, it's it is I hate to say that it's a bad show, but it's just it's just not even close to being on par with the Golden Girls. And Chris, you I don't know if you'll uh, you'll disagree with me, but I, I, the Golden Girls is such a perfect show. It's so well written and acted and you be it's believable. It's it's an awesome show and it holds up today. Um, yes. Golden yeah. Palace does not at all. It doesn't hold up. You know, I just decided. So there you go. Ah! This, has been, this has been on my to-do list for since I got to review the book is to finally do this cookie recipe that's haunting my dreams in this. I've just decided I'm as soon as this is done, I'm making it because yeah, I have some, I have a little bit of time this week because the new month is out. Yahoo. Um, I'm, uh, I'm making these. I'm making it for teacher appreciation day. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, that's of course great. I'm gonna like have some off to the side for our family, but um, it's the the one that I'm so excited about. I can't find it, but um, I'm making it today. And this is Chris Taylor's cookie cookbook recipe book. It's beautiful, <laughs> isn't it? That's the thing of beauty. There are so many cookie recipes in here that I want to try. But there's one in particular. It's the method in particular that I'm like uh, that's haunting me. The um the bronzed butter. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. But how many how many recipes are in this thing? It is so many. I, I can't even get over it. And if you look right there is the are the are the books. So uh -huh. and it, it, it it's these are works of art. They also. are they're just beautiful. And look at that. 2250 is is a smoking deal. Get yours. We we did I ordered one and and Chris it's it's just awesome. And on your Kindle, how interesting. Look at that. Oh, look at that. There you go. Yeah. And they're all just smoke show cheese coins. What the hey? They're so <laughs> clever. Oh, I love it. Tiger tails. Oh my gosh. That's the other one. We're obsessed with tiger tail, tiger, tiger. Oh gosh. Yes. Uh, tomato jam. Like it's everything that I love and things I never even thought about. <laughs> Cookie. I'm so excited. Uh, Chris, is, yeah. when, when are you and Paul, when are you and Paul going to come out to California and, maybe spend a little time with some friends in a wonderful little wine community in uh, Paso Robles, <laughs> California. I heard that, that that might happen at some point because there might be some people who want to maybe spend a little time with you as well. You know what we need to do? We need to have Fruit Loop cereal. Oh my gosh, Fruity Pebbles. Fried green tomato sandwiches. <laughs> um, we just have, we should have him. We should see the bronze butter chocolate chip. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I'm... That's what it has to happen. Um, we should have him do a like a demo. That'd be so fun to do a demo on the wineries here, wouldn't it? Yes. Like yes, award-winning author and cookie and pie master. He do could also do. He could do. A, 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 they could do a class at the at the the art studio that you do where you do your classes. Oh, for sure. Um, or. Yeah, or or that that can be maybe a half and half class of you and and then Chris, which would be really. We're, just, we're filling up his schedule right now. Yeah, so we're not busy. <laughs> the the ideas are are are, are out there, Chris. So, <laughs> so it just takes a little time for you and Paul to come on out and 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 enjoy some time with some friends. Thai coconut macaroon bars. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, that's so good. Yeah. Okay, the most beautiful ones, grapefruit and pistachio stained glass slices. Those are just so beautiful. There's so many in here that I'm obsessed with. I'm obsessed with them all. But, oh, yeah, that's right there. This this picture right here, I'm just, every time I'm like, oh, it's breathtaking. Look at that. Oh. Look at that. Pistachio and grapefruit. So, so you're in San Francisco June 4th and 5th. 
and then you head out uh and and i see your note to portland on the 6th so but you can come back and that's good that's good we're actually going to be in san francisco area on june 4th as well and we're going to be there because we're going to the jack white concert yahoo and it's it's my daughter's birthday and we're going to the jack white concert and it's it's gonna be awesome <laughs> Okay, this is on my. I'm doing this right after this. I'm I'm so excited. All right, so here here are some more comments on Golden Palace. Podcast. Oh, really? Interesting. I will That's check fine. that out. I love that. That's so fun. There's a podcast about it. That's cute. Huh? Hmm. String of pearls. How cute. Is it a succulent? I'm guessing. Um. Yeah. That's what. It, yeah. That's, That's what you had to wait for. You had to wait for your your March and April to be done in order to to dig into the book. Yeah, <laughs> it's here. I'm excited. Oh, good. Nice. Yeah, that's me too. It's like, yay, brown butter is amazing. And then you're gonna kick it up a notch. <laughs> oh, yes, please. Oh, that's cool. So good. Um, yeah. Yay. Oh yeah. So Mind blowing, yeah. Yay! Uh, yeah, fun, right. fun. It's a yeah. It's a season. Yeah. Oh, uh, emptiness. I'm about emptiness too. Liz, know. what was the name of the dog? Dreyfus. Yeah, right? that's right. <laughs> I don't. Wow. <laughs> I know. I don't know why that just sticks in my brain. Because he was such a sweet guy with beautiful red hair. And I'm like, oh my gosh, they have Dreyfus. Their hair looks like Dreyfus. Most beautiful color ever. And Dreyfus first made his his initial appearance on... on Golden Girls. Wow. What a star. Yes. <laughs> okay. Now I'm I'm all into... I'm... So I yeah, ready. I do have a couple of homeworks to share and some know? comments. Yes, I do. Um, oh. And then, and then we also have patches to go over. So, oh, I thought we were. I thought I was ready to go make my bronzed butter. Okay, <laughs> not yet. Okay, not yet because I know that that people are waiting to see this. So okay. I, I'm waiting. I I, I want to represent. I want to be here for you. So. Let's uh, let's first dig into uh, into a couple of homeworks. Now, again, I don't really show um, the, the homework from last month mm -hmm. because if you're going to be late, you don't get your homework shown. They're you not late. They're not late. Oh, I'm sorry. If you're going to get yours in at the 11th hour, yet on time. <laughs> Then, uh, th then I can't show them because we're into the next month and I've got to be forward forward focused. So. With that in mind, I do have a couple from last month that I'm going to show. Um, and these are because it is their first homework ever. And so they need to get a little love. And this is from Kim Buono. Is it is it Buono? B-U-O-N-O. B -U -O -N -O. I'm going to go with Buono. Buono? Buono? Yes. So this is Kim's first homework that she's ever done. She's so stoked cute. Magoo you and this is this is her first one. Those florals are great. Awesome job. Yes. And then this is Terry Whalen's first homework. How cute. How cute. The blue. The blue roses. Wow. I knew you'd like that fun. one too. Yeah. And then uh <laughs> the last one that, that I'm going to show is this one. This is Rebecca Judd. <laughs> and it's her first homework as well. It's so cute. Now she said, it's been almost 40 years since I decorated, and I started again in December when Charlotte Judd wanted to decorate cookies at Christmas. Many of you knew my mom, who was a certified Wilton instructor for cake decorating. Uh -huh. She taught me a lot while I was growing up. I needed to refresh uh -huh. my skills and learn new techniques, so I joined Artie Magoo You, an amazing online school for cookie decorating. I highly recommend it for anyone wanting to develop cookie decorating skills. The cookies were for April's lesson, and I finished them today. And then she followed up with, um, with in a comment, and I just had to share this with you because I know that you spend a, a lot of time to 
to do this right. And she said, I am loving the online venue. So much work has gone into content creation and actual delivery. It is all very impressive. I have spent a lot of time watching videos and have incorporated many of the techniques into other projects I have done. Awesome. My goal is to do the monthly projects and get them posted so everyone can see them. Isn't that sweet? Yeah, and those cookies were charming, weren't they? Yes. So absolutely. good. That's awesome. And then um, uh, we do have a couple more. Um, this one is Melanie Talkington, oh, and wow. she... She donated these. This is, um, she said, I've had this floral platter in my head for a while and finally got to make it for a silent auction don uh, donation benefiting Covenant Care Adoption Services. Oh, wow. And so this is uh, McGoober's Lend a Hand and she got her uh, her uh, uh, patch for that. Yeah, those are stunning. And then the next one and the last one, this is Don Nelson. She also did a donation. I donated this large platter of cookies to an elementary school auction. They procured... Mm -hmm. 25 donations of different desserts. They put them on display at the end of the dinner, which did not include dessert. Each table of 10 bids together to bid on one dessert to share. Oh. Brilliant way to raise lots of money and a great way to make a donation without spending an arm and a leg. Thank you to BRP Box Shop for the large box that... Uh, yeah, that, that looks so pretty. Yeah, from the cookie con samples. This box was perfect to display large platters. That is such a brilliant idea. And that those are beautiful cookies. I love that you buy your, your dessert for the table. Yeah. So cute. Oh, it's so awesome. cool. So cool, you guys. Yeah. Everybody did so great. Oh, this is great. Yeah. Too cool. Yeah, yeah. Love it. I love that we can like share so much awesomeness with our communities with cookies. It's so, you know, it's always yes always appreciated and amazing and you know yeah uh the hashtag is magoobers lend a hand and that's for that um oven mitt patch yes and i know you guys do it all the time you know you guys put your ovens to good use all the time that's right yeah and it's great to see i love that so would you guys like to see the uh who who earned patches in april Patches. Got it ready. All right. Let's start off with the piping bag. So can you describe the piping bag patch? This patch is earned when you do your current uh, month of homework three months in a row. So three current consecutive homeworks turned in. You turn it in with a hashtag, Magoo you homework. You share it on your page and then can... Um, Share it to the group so that Mr. John can give you credit. He's in charge of tracking down everybody's homework, which is quite a task. Uh, so that helps him kind of keep track. So when you post it to your page and then share it to the group, that's a really good way to connect it to either your cookie page or your personal page. And so he, he, can, he can keep track easily that way. And the piping bag patches are for Angie and Deborah. Sharon, Wendy, Tessie, Leanne, Debbie, Kate, Kelly, Marcy, Kevlin. Wow, we got a lot here. This is Debbie, there we are. They've all earned their piping bag patch. That's three months in a row. Turns yes. Beautiful homework. <laughs> they do. Yes, they do. Patches rock, people. They do. All There's right. So uh, let's see, next up. The is... rolling pin patch. This is for doing, in, um, instead of that fourth pie bag patch, this is what you get for doing a year of homework. Paula, Jenny, um, wait, why does it have a little imprint? Okay. What does that mean? So um, for rolling pin patches. Oh. This is for mixing. No, no, no. No, no, no. Rolling pin patches are here. Hold up. That was a list of mixers, isn't it? That was. That you're you're good at this game. I can tell. You're <laughs> very good at this game. <laughs> Rolling pin, a year of cookie homework. That is amazing. And some of these, this isn't their first rolling pin, which means they've done years. Of That's homework. right. That's right. There you so, go. Cheryl. 
Janice and Angie. Oh, we still kicked it off with Angie though, huh? Yes. <laughs> awesome. Rolling no. pin touches. Little info on Angie. Um, she participated in the makeup homework that we did in, in January and February. So um, it, this is something that we did for the first time this year. We gave all students the opportunity to go back and to fill in holes in their homework and to, to make up some of the, the work that they missed over the last few years. So um, uh, Angie ended up doing that. And I didn't see it because um. I was looking at other things. So she ended up showing me, uh, tagging me in posts, and she is right on. So nice. good yay yeah that year that you earn that that's that's a lot yeah uh life gets in the way and um so that's that's a commitment you know so cool oh you'll be good time becky just wow, uh, in the year and you can you can end up uh, uh if you have questions about that you can uh, uh you can message me on uh on facebook and i'll be able to answer any questions you can call me email text whatever i, I got you fantastic year with becky I'm excited. Uh, we do have, yo. Oh, oh yeah. It's the one because we have the two lands. Oh, uh, yes. yeah. Yeah. We're, we're working on that. I know we're we talked about that last that. week. That's right. Yeah. I, I apologize. I have not had the time to actually sit and go, okay, which Leanne Peterson is this? <laughs> yeah. You know what? To have multiple John Adams, I get, but a Leanne Peterson is, I know. That's, that's different. Great. And it's just the difference of a space, right? <laughs> Um, no, I mean, you can just, uh, um, on your settings, right? There's a, there's a way to do it that way. Unless your card has expired. I think you can just, um, Mr. John will it'll just renew. Yeah. yeah, it will renew, just renew, but just make sure that, that your payment method is up to date on your, right. on your profile. Your yeah. So, uh, the next patch the right here patch is our brand new patchy patch. This one is when you post publicly, and that's six months of public six months homework. Work. That's right. Boom. Look at you, Angie, with a whip. Yeah. And yeah, and since that's new, I think the only way you can get that right now is if you took advantage of that makeup work, right? And kind of yeah. extended your your that's right. If you did a couple of the of the homeworks, uh, the, the makeup works, then you can be earning that patch. So uh, next month will be, or this month would be if you haven't, if you haven't done any of the makeup work, you're you're going to be at five already, and you need six months of those public posts in order to earn the whisk. So one uh, end of June, a, a whole bunch of people are going to be earning it. So this will be great. Yeah, so cool. That's a fun one. It's cute. Yes, it is. It is. For sure. Um, mixers, mixer patches. This is where you share your love of Maguyu with your friends, and they join. So that's when somebody joins as a, a Magoober annual Magoober. Paula wrangled her friend Jenny. Christy got her friend Till. Aunt Michelle got Ella to join. Now. Ella put down Aunt Michelle. Uh -huh. I just don't know who Aunt Michelle is. Oh no, I love Aunt Michelle. I love Aunt Michelle. She's my belle. But um, yeah, it's I, I got to know who Michelle is. So Michelle, you got to speak up. Michelle, my belle, you got a patch coming your way. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that's cute. So next up, here you go. This is the oven mitt. Oven mitt. This is where you lend your oven mitted hand for a good cause and donate cookies to an amazing um, community effort, uh, benefiting someone else outside of yourself or your family. I mean, if it if it like kind of affect, uh, in what was the word I just used? I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> if it benefits your family, that's fine. But you know, if they're involved in the situation, but it should be some you know some uh, group outside your yourself um yes. john nelson and melanie talkington as we saw their beautiful contributions so cool yes um, now this one is is this highly is coveted m. highly coveted this is the big m this is if you have taken an advanced class in person 
or if you have referred a friend and got your mixer patch, this is what you get your first time first for a friend for your first referral. Look at this. There were, and there were a lot of in-person advanced classes recently. So a lot of people earned that M. But I don't have the folks from, from the class that you did in Texas. And I oh, know, wow. is, it, uh, is it Ashley that, that was in that class? Um, yeah. So, so there are a few people that I know got a, a, a oh, okay. star or an M and yes. I don't know who that is. So we're going to have to get that list. Uh, too. D, Kim, Heidi, Robin, there she is, Margaret, Stacy. Yes, we had a blast. <laughs> Danielle and Christy. So some of those were for referrals and some of those were for in-person classes. Chris and Danielle was a, I think she was her fourth or fifth star that she star. Has, she's gotten. Yeah, so some of those were the star um, pins or patches. And I will get you that list because, um, yeah, there were quite a few M's at the, the roundup. Becky was one of them. We got her star. Awesome. So cool. That's right. Um, yeah, that's, wow. That's a lot of patches going out. Yes, it is. It is a lot of patches and just a lot, a lot going on. Now, I... The, the little purple hanging out right here that I used for this month. Such a good purple. Look at it. It's still matching my nails. Deep purple. It's a good one. <laughs> well, I know that that today there's there's a lot with the brand new class. You have uh, we had all the patches, lots of homework, lots of things. And oh, Laura got her apron patch. That was the one that was that was missing. And is that right? And then got re resent last week. Is that right? I don't oh, know. Got the apron. You got the apron this month? No, you got the other apron last month. Well, I mean, it was yes. four last month, but she probably just got it. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah, it is a good purple. Americolors too blue. Wilton's too pink. This one, it's just right, right, the right purple, you know? Yes. Now, th there is a question in reference to um, to to the, the class this month. Uh -huh. So we're going to dip into the mailbag <laughs> and because I have a question from Paula Price. So um, uh, thank you, Laura. You yeah. Know, wasn't missing. You just got yours. That's it, yeah. All right. So here you go. Is the flower or the flower consistency piping or floral? Will piping hold its shape? So, uh, yeah, she said, I, I thought flowers were supposed to be stiffer or they will not hold their shape. Mm. In this case, so when I when we did the toothpick roses, I say air on the side of really thick. This one is not as particular, it's which is really nice. It doesn't have to be as super overly thick. Um, you will get a little bit more ruffling, you know, a little more um, kind of uh, precision in that if you, if you want that. But I found that it works with a softer piping too, and it looks nice. Um, I almost feel like it's a little easier, especially with the pansy, if it's a little, you know, not quite as, as thick, thick, thick um, to get the look that I want to get at that flat open petal. So yeah, that's a really good question. So this one I find not as particular and it, you can work with more of a range. So if you really like to pipe florals with the really thick, you totally can. But if you if you want it to be a little thinner, it will, it will work lovely. Um, I feel like our... Yeah, there they are. These were kind of, yeah, they were a little softer than what I would normally do roses with. They're both of the flowers, the iris and the pansies. They're they're more forgiving as far as the, the um, consistency of the icing. So that's a great question. Excellent. Um, yeah, I, I, I have a couple of them, like where one was like thicker and one was thinner. And they really both look, they look lovely and they work really nicely. So Excellent. Yeah. Now, I that that is the only question that we had um, on it, from the mailbag. Yeah, I feel like when we did it with, with Tammy, it was it was a little thinner and it worked great. I thought. But we might as well do another question right now. Squeezable. Oh. There you go. 
What type of food can I use since I took the class in Hindi? So great. <laughs> um, so specifically for the purple, um, it was the artisan accents. I did for the really deep purple, I mixed it with midnight, which is like a navy, so that I would get that really, really deep uh, color. Also, there is a, do you want to show them where the supply list is? You want to show them oh, that? Absolutely. Um, so in the supply list, there are clickable links on a lot of them. The color in this case isn't clickable, but I did put the brand in the supply list up at the top. Usually I use Americolor. Um, I used two different brands this month, though, and they're they're on the the supply list. So right here, you see the the Artie Magoo website, and of course, you go right there to Magoo U online classes. And since I am definitely a subscriber, I will click either here or here and go right into the class. And right here is the supply list. You can click on the little the little picture of the PDF or click here. So this time, I'll pick I'll click here, <laughs> and that's the PDF for the class. It's all right here, all of the uh, the tools and supplies, exactly which brushes, it's all right there. Yeah, and the, the thing is, is you can use different colors, of course, but I do put what I use. Um, and then if there's a link, it's exactly what I used or something very similar. Usually it's exactly what, what I use. And you don't, you can feel free to use something else. You know, you're like, oh, I don't have that exact purple or that exact color. You are, feel free to use what you have for sure, but it's good to, to know what you know, what I use, if you want to know, there's Jacqueline Terrell. She was our amazing expert guest. She talks about develop your own recipes and uh, really fun to talk to. Uh, those are great segments. You want to watch those. The uh, smart cookie is another design because you're going to make a ton of flowers. Oh, these are, this is another way to use it. Your, your cute little florals and the extra frosting using up the extra frosting from class. What a fun yeah. month. Yay. So springy. Yes, it is. Yeah. Now, let's see here. Um, ah. Really? How fun. Wow. That's a lot of hot air balloons. It is, yeah. Oh, another I mean, question. I would say it's thicker than that. I would go thicker than writing. Um, so if it comes out of your mixer as as like lettering consistency, I would get I would get a little thicker. Because um, I would say the pansies would be fine almost, but maybe maybe still a little bit soft because you don't want it to to um, relax it into itself too much. You want to still keep some nice, you know, separate dimensions. Um, I would say you'll get more ruffling, especially in the irises, if it's thicker. So so it kind of an in between for the pansy and the iris. I would say a little thicker than writing would be would be good. What brush did you use? That's the, the Kingmas little detail brush. And that one is linked in the supply list. So it'll, it'll take yes, you sir. directly to, to where you can get that. I love that brush so much. And it's like a lifetime supply for $7. You just can't beat it. Um, Cindy Turner turned me on to the Kingmas brushes years ago. And I, I just love them. I love the short little, little handle. It's a great one. Um, baking your crease tomorrow. Yay. Um, nice. I'm so to share this. I yeah, I can't wait to see them. And how are you feeling, Sheila? Is everything going well? I hope so. She has yeah, physical therapy and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, something was... to look forward to. Yay! Yes, I can't wait to see them. I did pipe um, the the pansies in a different color, and I showed them in the video. Um, I think I have them. Where, where did they go? Maybe they're outside, actually. I did I did pipe them in, in all different colors, and that was really fun. Cool. So and I kind of showed um the the kind of the pattern that I did in the in the little you know icing bullet and how they turned out as a flower. So that's kind of a, a fun option to do too. You want to want to want to tell them pansy. Yeah, yeah. I think um, Paula Price is peppering you with 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 her questions today. There's this such is good questions too. Hey, take advantage. It. Go for it. Yeah. Yeah. And I suggest trying it because um, I'd love to see them larger. You know, um, you will have probably less if you use the same cutters, you'll probably, you know, you'll, you'll use less flowers in the, on the cookie, but I think they'd be adorable. Like to have like three bigger pansies in that pot. I think they would be so cute. Uh, three weeks post-surgery tomorrow. Oh my gosh. Yeah. 
That's that's good. And you could still it didn't affect your hands any, so that's nice. Have someone else bake the cookies for you and <laughs> do all the prep. <laughs> I'll sit over here and you prep for me and then I'll just decorate. <laughs> so yeah, I haven't tried making it with the larger tip. I have made it with the 101 regular and I loved just that bump up in size. So I'm, I'm thinking the 102 would be lovely. I should try that right now. I still have icing. I should just switch out the tip and <laughs> after, after this. <laughs> yes, exactly. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Oh, Mm. Dang! Well, I I went and and I did prepare cookie news for today. Oh, however, it's like waiting for you, <laughs> just stretching this out. I'm like, <laughs> no, it's no, it's all good because uh, you know typically the, the the first the first Monday of the month, this is what it is. It's focusing on the patches, on the new class, yeah. on answering some questions, and and getting everybody set up right. And then, and then week two, we have cookie news and I am set up for it. So I will bring that next week, but we, I won't be here. Is that right? Right. So would you a field trip? Yes, that's right. We do have a field trip. And what is this field trip for? This field trip is for our wonderful, amazing, brilliant daughter our oldest daughter is graduating from college what? how did we get here i can't believe it she's not just graduating she's graduating from asu which is my alma mater um with honors from the honors college uh barrett and she is graduating magna where did she come from how did that's crazy so cool we're a little bit proud she also graduated a year early mm -hmm. which is crazy crazy kid she's so great and she's graduating from college uh, seriously i don't how did we how did we do this john how did whose kid is she <laughs> are, we, are we old enough to have a, a college graduate yes we're definitely well i mean yeah, yeah. <laughs> i don't feel i don't feel like that should be a thing that's true. I do feel that is a little weird, but watching her doing her schoolwork. Yeah, she's, she's uh, so smart. The way she did college. Yes, we're, we're there. <laughs> she just, man, she piled it on. Yeah, so she defended her uh, her honors thesis the other week. Did amazing. We have to watch that. Whoo, wild stuff. Yeah, so, uh, we'll be we'll be at her graduation. We'll be we'll be at her graduation this time. No, yes. we'll still do the live. Because mm -hmm. the time works out that day, um, but we'll we'll have a, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Apparently, yeah. Thank you. Crazy. Yeah, we're we're kind of beaming. Oh, Great. wow, wow, that's wild. We yeah. have a little adult human, you know. That is. It came fast. It came way faster than. Uh, <laughs> Agreed. Than Agreed. I, we just got married. Wait, what? No. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, we're celebrating 24 years of marriage in June. Yeah. 24. <laughs> this is fast. This is. <laughs> I love how every every year of marriage, when we were first married, oh, this this first year is the hardest, and we're like, oh, okay. Then the second year, they're like, oh, this is always the hardest year of marriage. Like, oh, okay, <laughs> every year they've stopped saying that now. People stop saying that. Yeah. Uh, but <laughs> also, like it, people are or people would say, oh, well, well, year number one, that's the paper anniversary. And oh yeah. Year number two is tin, and then I think three is wood and. Sure. I have no idea what 24 is. <laughs> I think it's you just des you deserve a nap. Do you deserve a nap year? Yeah, yeah. I think that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Well, if you'd like, since you are going to be gone next week, I am more than happy to share cookie news today. If it's not time sensitive, I say we wait. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I. <laughs> Is there a cookie year? 24. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The 24th year is the cookie year. Naps and cookies. <laughs> I can handle that. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, cookie it, year. <laughs> it's not time sensitive. We're all good. It, <laughs> it, 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 it is great, but yeah, it's, it, it'll be, it'll be some fun stuff. There's, there's some I video. Love some I love it. Yeah. It'll be, it'll be great. So but I I'm, will I'm, have it. I'm chomping at the bit to get to my recipe book. Now that I have that, that, Yes. Oh list. I'm ready. <laughs> That's great. So we'll have everybody wait for cookie news next next week. Um, I, I will try to bring it with us to Arizona and we'll try to do it from our from our hotel. And okay. that'll be a lot of fun. And then well, yeah, we'll be we'll be ready to go. It'll be great. Um yeah. You would be so tired. Why? Oh, because I'm driving to Arizona from California that you know <laughs> we're all all in a day's work it's all good yeah it'll be great all right friends you guys are fantastic i enjoy you i, enjoy you. I look forward to chatting with you guys it's so great uh but we'll see you next uh yeah where's my outro music yeah um <laughs> did, did we decide that this was it yeah, that's what I'm, I'm feeling that, right? Yeah. <laughs> we'll have to make some uh, we'll be here next Monday, live from Tempe, Arizona. Yes. But with our soon to be graduate. It'll be hours away from her graduation ceremony. So. Fantastic. Yay. So we'll see you next Monday. And in the meantime, have a delicious day. <laughs>